Okay, I'm going to do this song. Um, this is a song that I wrote kind of as a, it was, it was a healing process for me. Um, my grandmother has Alzheimer's and has had it for many years, and it's, it was an easy thing to not talk about, not really, you don't, you don't want to think about it. It's, very, it's a very sad thing. Um, it's a slow decay of the brain, and eventually um, that person forgets everyone around them, even their children and, uh, you know, people that they, they knew all their lives. Um, but this is my song for my grandmother. This is called Unraveling. And um, when I wrote it, I, I had no idea that it would mean anything to anyone else. But I've got an overwhelming response from people. And um, anyway, this is, this is unraveling. So um, it was, it's, it's a funny thing when you write for your own in healing. And then it it's means something to someone else. So um, I hope this means something to you. Boxes and baskets of all her old things, porcelain dolls, portrait paintings, she swore they'd be worth something. They're just gathering dust in my attic somewhere, and she's lost in a room where she sits and she stares, her mind as blank as the wall. Her memory is vacant as the halls. And I'm the only daughter of her oldest son. I knew her well before her spirit was gone. And her life is a thread woven into every part of me. She is unraveling, she is unraveling. She looks in my eyes and asks me my name. And every five minutes I tell her the same. She smiles, but it's cold and dead. And I'm screaming out loud in my head. I knew her well before her spirit was gone, and her life is a thread woven into every part of me, and she is unraveling, she is unraveling. Stories and photographs of her children who love her, sisters and brothers. She can't remember, but how could a heart forget? I'm the only daughter of her oldest son. I knew her well before her spirit was gone. Is a thread woven into every part of me, and she is unraveling. She is unraveling. I've been tearing through boxes on nights I can't sleep, searching for memories of who she used to be. Thank you.